Hi, and welcome back to another Garbage Pail Kid Bounty Hunter video. It's been a long time. Sorry about the absence, but there just really hasn't been anything worth opening, in my opinion. Till these little babies came out, we have the Dress to Grotesque set. Released in a five packs, eight cards per pack, kind of like a blaster box, more or less. But these have some goodies inside. We're supposed to get a sketch in each box, which, you know, I love sketches. So that's awesome for me. So we're going to rip these open. I doubt we'll be able to get a full set, but we should have some extras. With those extras, we can trade and hopefully finish this set off. Um, that way I can put it into me online sets. But how have you guys been doing? It's been quite some time, like I said. You guys are doing okay out there. I know GPK is uh, a little more dead than it was two years ago, um, but I'm still enjoying it. I just don't enjoy it quite as often because they're being real slow with the sets and not a whole lot coming out. Uh, I know we got Chrome on the horizon supposedly sometime this year, but we have not even seen a second set this year, which is weird, especially how early kids at play came out, you would think we would have already had something, at least heard something about the next set, but I guess we'll see what happens. So let's get into these bad boys. I do have some uh, other stuff to open and I do want to do a video about sketches. Uh, that will hopefully happen soon. I have one on the way to me from one of my favorite artists of oh, my favorite character um so that would be pretty awesome so i'll wait to film that one to when i have that card Boom. so i've seen a lot of this for sale singles and sealed product you got the folks who just bought it to sell it that are out there asking the high prices but you know is what it is was a pretty limited product. Took about half an hour to an hour to sell out, which honestly, compared to the Valentine's Day sets, um, surprised me it took that long. It's probably because they're $100 a piece for this little thingy. But unlike Valentine's, you're, everyone comes with a sketch, or so they say. And it seems like there's a lot more uh, kind of cool, more limited stuff in it. So let's see what we get. Welcome for the ride. Draft a grotesque eight cards. Nice simple wrapper design. Try to keep one of these in nice condition. I can put it in the binder next to the set. All right, success. Oh, these are super duper bossy. Yeah. Ah. Uh, Okay, we've got Zenful Zendaya. I guess this is going to be Zendaya from uh, Spider-Man movies and such. There we go. We've got a nice focus. I'll get my blade out of the way so we can put these down. There's Nat Nerd. There are uh, A and Bs. There are Cs, which are going to be a little tougher to find. And then certain cards, like I know Nat Nerd's one of them. There'll be no letter, and there'll be a slight variation to the artwork. And those are selling pretty high. I think price will come down a bit. I think everybody gets the FOMO and wants to get them pretty quick. There's Cyclops. He's got a pretty cool uh, jacket there. Okay, here is a green foil blasted billy. And these are out of 25, so they're fairly obscure and the you know low quantity of the garbage bell kids. There's outer space chase. He's another one with a I guess you call it a chase card. Uh, the little, I know on that one the little hat blue. A Fran Fran. Classic character. I mean these all kind of a little more punk rock. Another one has bat wings coming out of the head. 
Clark Kent. Last card is Marty Malfo. So that would be a new character. Maybe kind of like a heart cart thing. I've been wanting to try for some of the the Bowman Chrome did garbage pill kid inserts of you know players kind of like they did with the MLB which the GPK stuff but they're only available in baseball product and it's pretty pricey and they're pretty tough to pull so when they come out with the mega boxes which are a little less expensive I'll probably get a few to rip it seems like a fun time wrinkly Randy so I'm hoping there's a rock and robber it double Heather Nasty Nick, classic. Got quite the lapel there. Brian Ryan, I believe Chris Meeks did this one. One of the nice things about this set was we're seeing some uh, sketch artists get into doing final art for these tops releases, which is pretty awesome. Conflict Colin, Marshy Marshall, looking to fly. JDK, looking like the manager of The Undertaker, Paul Bear. And Chris Hiss. So no fancy foil. I don't remember what the odds are. I don't know if you get one foil per, per box, one per so many packs, not sure. But there are also uh, pack cards in here, which I'm not the biggest fan of, but the Adam Bob one looks pretty cool. We went back to kind of the roots when I did old ones and uh, it's supposed to be a piece of his tie. That's the bit of a pack. Alligator. And I'm not cheating and uh, looking for fatter cards in here. I'm just literally opening them up. Mozzarella Ella. I don't know who that's supposed to be. And the look Raquel Welsh look to it. But clothing Lady Gaga would wear. Weird Wendy. She just decided to go all hat. There's a wrapper card. Those are in here too. So that's of the Zendaya card. So maybe the wrappers are only of the new art. Maggie Maggie, more hat action. All hat all the time. Unzip Zach. We have Bony Tony in here. He's unzipped more than just his face. Animal Kenny. A lot of animal print on Mr. Kenny. He's walking upright these days, though. So. Red Sauce Rihanna. Oh, I guess this was a Rihanna. Now I know. Anyone care for pizza? So we've gotten a green card and a wrapper card bet this pack probably doesn't have a special card and then hopefully the sketch cards please i'm supposed to get one please but who knows all just guessing here jared let go so it's a jared leto joke There's Adam Bomb. Mr. Kimball would have fun with this one. Babbling Brook, a little PB and J action. Got it spilled all over that nice, uh, nice outfit. New Wave Dave. He has a another card. I can't remember what the difference is. I don't think I've ever seen it, but he's got the alternate one. Zipped Upton. Oh, so maybe the oh, that's a C card. Okay, so in this pack we got a C card. There you go. Jelly Kelly. Richie Ratch. 
It's managed to just wear an outfit made of completely bark. Another one. There's Rock and Robert. Sweet. All right, last pack. Grim Jim. This one's special because I'm a huge Mike Stevens fan and he did the art for this. Another sketch artist doing into some production work, which is awesome. Electric Katie. Like something Lady Gaga would wear. Alien Ian. Oh, there we go. Sketch by one Mr. Darren Pepe. Great sketch artist. Been doing this for a long time. Always brings the goods. Kind of a grayscale sketch. Not full color, but a lot of detail, a lot of time went into this. And that's just looking at it through the camera. Very cool. Chard Chad. Meeks, as mentioned before. Oh, and Beth Death. We got both of the Stevens. Luft Lady. That's probably Lady Gaga. Lady Gaga, who took the theme of this year to a whole new level. And Avo's favorite, Messy Tessie, Leaky Lindsay. Okay, so that gets us through the first one. Why the heck not? I'm trying to make a set, and I know I don't have it, so. Let's open up numero dos. Five more packs. 40 more cards. This is a 60 card set. I'm going to have 80 cards and some of them are going to be taken up by parallel. So it's like I said, pretty unlikely I'll do it, but hopefully we can get close and have a few extras to swap out what we need. If anybody else watching this is collected and needs some or has some extras, let me know. Make this happen. Gigantic Gown Gaga. Mark Bark. Zenful Zendaya again. I got doubles of that one. Marty Mouthful. 25 and 25. Got a bookend there. If anyone collects bookends. Acme Amy. Perry Winkle. Oh, maybe that's Katy Perry. Katy Perry teased that she was going to light up the Met Gala, and light up the Met Gala she did in a full chandelier. Outer Space Chase again. Double him and double a Fran Fran. No doubles. Means I'm not going to get my set. That nerd. Difference on him is the price tag here. If you find an alternate one. I mean, it's easy to tell because they don't have a letter on them. Cyclops. Okay, Randy. Uh-oh. This isn't good looking good. We're getting lots. Oh, there's a C card. Artie Invader. A C card. Or can't. Oh, no. Marty Mouthful. Marshy Marshall. I'm not getting... Not getting new cards. Got a, got a repeat of the first box. No. Nasty Nick. Weird Wendy. Mozzarella Ella. Yeah, these are all doubles. And the wrapper card was a new one at least. I like the 25 cheap it pops on there. J to K. These are thick boys too, just like the online sets have been this past year. Chris Hiss. Aggie Maggie. Unzip Zach. 
Why does that pack? Okay, so we've got the C, the wrapper, and the green, so. I don't think we will get another Fancy Pants card other than a sketch, but who knows? Bony Tony. Producer Greg. Here I'd let go. And a bomb again. We haven't got a blast of Billy except for that green one. 90s Nigel. I think I needed that one. I think I got the other one. Kenny we got. That's us Rihanna we got. I don't know if we got Babbling Brook or Jelly Kelly earlier. It's either one I need or a double. Who knows? The last pack. Babbling Brook. New Wave Dave. Grim Jim again. Neil Camara with the Cheeky Charles. Shrunken Ed. Another fine black and white sketch. Not a rush job by any means. Did wish I got a little more color. I like me some colorful sketch cards, but what are you gonna do? Richie Wretch. Rock and Robert. Shark Chat again. Beth Death again. All right, folks. I'm gonna get this uh, kind of sorted and see what we need, and I'll get a list together, but. It was fun opening anyways. It's pretty cool knowing you get a sketch when you open something. Um, especially since sketches have gotten so kind of tough to find. You don't, you don't bump across them as much as you used to. If you've watched any of my openings, you know that it's been kind of a while since I've gotten a you know, sketch. I think actually my last video I did, but I opened a lot of Inner Galactic to get one sketch. Um, but uh, anyways, thanks for spending a few minutes with me. And uh, like I said, I'll have another video of something that's really up my alley. And I think you'll enjoy too. So stay tuned for that. And now time to go edit this and get it ready to rock and roll.